So Evernote has made a few little changes in how we use notes. Hi, I'm Dave Edwards. Today, I want to show you what that's all about. I'm a certified Evernote expert, as it says uh, right there. Uh, that means that I passed a certification uh, to become a certified Evernote expert. And Evernote allows me to sit in on periodic calls with the project team. So I learn a little bit about the inner workings of what Evernote is working on, and I try to share as much as I can with you. And actually, I've really found that there's like two different types of Evernote users. Uh, one is the person who uses Evernote as a place to store stuff. Uh, everything from articles they want to read to files they want to have instant access to. And those kind of people do most of the work inside of notebooks. Some people just have one gigantic notebook and then rely on the search feature to find uh, the items that they want or they use tags or something else. Other people have a lot of different notebooks. So that's one type of user. The other type of user is the one who uses Evernote as really kind of their home base for their productivity system. And those kinds of users primarily live within notes. Oh yes, they have notebooks and tags and everything else, but they're constantly working inside of notes as well as notebooks. So Evernote has made a few little tweaks as to how we type and how we input data into our notes. And I wanna show you what they've done. So when you have a note like this, whatever you might be working on, um, how do you start a new paragraph? Well, now you can start a new paragraph by simply clicking at the end of the text without having to hit the Enter key ever. A nice quick feature. You can also create a new line in the same paragraph by coming up here. And now you can hit Shift and Enter. And now what you've done is you've created a new line in the same paragraph. These are subtle little changes, but if you create a lot of notes like I do, these are things that I think uh, you'll find invaluable. Uh, the other feature is adding attachment to your tables without changing the layout. Let me show you how to do that. I'm sometimes asked how you can put uh, pictures in alignment uh, if you wanted to do that or any other files. So now we can. Uh, if you notice, we have a Word document here that uh, you know takes up all of the real estate of this screen. But this could be a picture. This could be you know a PDF. It could be any number of other things. If I wanted to take this uh, file and put it into my table, you now can. All you do is you hold on it and you drag it up to the column or the place you want it to be. And now you see it's moved from here into your table, and if I changed the length of the table, it also changes the length of the file. So if you wanted to create a table with different pictures, uh, you could do that. Just put a number of pictures or whatever you want to put into the table, and then slide them into the appropriate uh, part of your table. Now remember, all of these new features came out with version 10.113. I'm always interested in your thoughts, how you use Evernote, questions you may have. Leave a comment below, or even better yet, send me an email to daveedwards at outlook.com. And if you want to make sure that you are using Evernote to its fullest, whether you're a brand new user or have been using it for some time, please check out my online course, Evernote for Beginners. I've really under, been undergoing the process of updating everything in this course uh, so if you subscribe now, uh, you will get the latest updates. And if you have subscribed to the course in the past, go back, check it out, because you have access to those updates as well. Evernote has been a game changer in my productivity journey. Over the years, I've used it to organize everything, ideas, tasks, notes, and more, keeping my workflow streamlined and efficient. But I've also seen how easy it is to download it and not fully tapping into its potential. Hi, I'm Dave Edwards, and that's why I created Evernote for Beginners, an online course designed to show you how to get the most out of this powerful tool. I'll help you unlock its full capabilities. Learn more at DaveEdwardsMedia.com and just click on Courses.